the load shedding regiment has become almost unbearable with some homes and offices going without power for three days straight. Umeme announced last week that there will be 24-hour load shedding throughout the country. The acute power shortage has been blamed on the decommissioning of the 50 megawatt agroecothermal power plant in Mutunde, Kampala. A parliamentary ad hoc committee was recently set up to investigate the high electricity tariffs, power losses and other contentious matters in the energy sector. The committee chairman says one of the major causes of the current crisis lies in the concession agreements between government and Umeme. This committee is likely to come up with some proposals on how the negotiations were done. Terms and conditions of that agreement you know, leaves a lot and, uh, to be desired. The committee has interviewed different stakeholders in the energy sector as per terms of references. Are ready and willing to give the information so that parliament can find a way forward, uh, lasting solutions in form of recommendations for that could do help the sector. The committee will make fact visits to some different East African countries to enrich their investigations. Drawing from lessons and best practices within the region, the East African region, may call for us to make a you know, fact-finding uh, visit to Kenya, where they are doing very well, their losses is down and they are being run. The facility, the utility is being run by government and then also Rwanda and Tanzania. More research all NTV at Parliament.